Hello everyone, welcome to Organ Trail, a ridiculous zombie survival game. And that is Organ Trail, not Oregon Trail. Organ as in zombies have stuck their hands into my innards and are now feasting upon my organs. That sort of organ. So, let's go. I have not played this before, but I have watched other people play it, so I know a little about what to do. Alright, let's go for normal. Here we go. Click on the enemy and draw a line towards yourself to shoot. Yeah, this game has a very weird shooting system. It's like this. It's very strange. Very strange. Oh god. Oh god. Oh shit, I'm out of ammo. Help me! Help me! Whoever you random sprite thing are is... Ah, thank you. Well then, it looks like I just saved your bacon. I reckon we stand a better chance out there if we stick together. My name is Clements. I used to be a priest. Not much use for those nowadays. What's your name, partner? My name is... Hmm. I'm not very good at coming up with names. Let me think. Alright, I think this might be painful to try to think. <sighs> <sighs> okay. Okay, I... I managed to produce an idea. I know what my name's gonna be. Man. The pleasure's all mine, man. Listen, oh god, I'm actually lightheaded from doing that. Oh, oh boy. <sighs> breathe slowly, breathe slowly. Trying to think of a name took all of my energy out of me. Okay. Listen, even with the two of us, we won't survive very long. Everyone I trusted died a while back. Do you know anyone we could count on in a pinch? Ooh, more names. Well, okay, I want the names to be very distinct so I don't have any trouble telling people apart because I really have a lot of trouble mixing up names, so... Okay, I think I've got it. John. John Bon. John Bon. John Bon. Oh, I can't. John Bon John. John Bon Bon Bon. John Bon Bon Bon. Sandwich casserole. Chocolate quail's eggs. Garlic pudding. Fluffy ruffs. Hoisin crispy owl. Pasta pillows. Bon 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 Bons. McFortune cookies. It's up to you. Okay. John, John Bon, John Bon John, and John Bon Bon Bon. Should be perfect. I don't think I can mix those up. Are these names correct? Yes, they are. There's a very good chance if they're still alive, uh, they will be at the shelter set up in DC, if they have any sense, that is. We're going to need a way to get around. I saw an old station wagon a few blocks back. Those things might not be very reliable, but you'd be surprised how roomy they are. Anyway, let's get moving. Use WASD or arrow keys to move. Okay. Can I shoot? Yes, I can. Oh, never mind. I have no ammo. Damn it. This game has amazing graphics. 10 out of 10. Beats Metro Last Light. Best graphics ever. Hello, Station Wagon. You look like a piece of shit. Alright, I think I've got just enough fuel and food for us to make it to DC and this baby. Let's hit the road. I'll drive. Here we go. Oh, Clements has a broken arm. What the fuck? Clements, how do you break your arm while driving a station wagon, dude? What? What? What, did you stick one arm through one of the holes in the steering wheel and then turn the steering wheel sharply with the other arm? What the fuck? Jesus, man. Okay. I can't remember where we're go <laughs> where we're going. Uh, Clements has dysentery. Clements? I hate to break it to you, but I don't think you're very good at survival. Okay, we've been driving for five seconds, and you've managed to break your arm and get dysentery, despite the fact that you're driving a car and have had nothing to eat. <sighs> oh, Clements. Clements. 
Clements was <laughs> Clements was bitten by a zombie. <laughs> okay, so in five to ten seconds, he managed to break his arm, get dysentery, and then get bitten by a zombie, all whilst driving. Oh, Clemens. And we're out of fuel. Great. And Washington, D.C. is a hellhole. Well, I'm going to die. Just as the station wagon runs out of fuel, you coast into the city. You can hear a radio blaring in a nearby window. Repeat, all survivors who still remain in Washington, D.C. The government has declared a Class 3 biohazard in the area. They will be commencing a nuclear strike within a few short hours. Get out while you can. The city is lost. Well, shit, we better go. Looks like we have a time problem. I'll go look for your friends at the shelter. Meanwhile, you should go scavenging for supplies. I've heard about a place on the west coast that is supposed to be a safe haven from all this chaos. Let's meet back here and head out. Here, take my journal. I've written down everything I know about surviving on the road. It should help you decide what you think we may need on the trip. Well, I guess his book about what he's uh, learned about surviving on the road doesn't include how to not break your arm while driving for two seconds. Pick the supplies you want to gather. Our remaining uh, 12. Okay. So basically, getting... Each blip of supplies takes one hour, so I get to decide how much of each thing I want. <clears throat> okay. Well, obviously I need ammo, a lot of it. If you run out of ammo, you're basically fucked. So I'm gonna go ahead and get 600. I... <laughs> I'll grab some extra mufflers, because in case you didn't know, mufflers just fall off of cars all the time. Grab a battery, grab a tire, a couple tires. Definitely grab some food, or else we're gonna die. Grab some medkits, and some fuel. Money is basically the least important thing from what I've seen. Alright, so we got a little bit of everything. So we can take anything that life throws at us. Okay, let's go. Your friends join the party! Sweet! Great, everyone's here. There's just one more thing. Back there on the road, one of those things bit me. I'm already not feeling too well, and I can't stand the thought of becoming one of them. You're gonna have to put me down. Why don't you keep my journal? It may help you out there. Good luck. Okay, now I get to shoot him. Uh, uh, uh. Well, I could be merciful and shoot him in the head. But, I'm gonna shoot him in the foot. I missed. Hold on, hold on. Okay, you're about to die, don't don't worry, just, it's okay. And in the foot. Goodbye, Clements. You poor incompetent bastard. 230 miles to Pittsburgh. Alright, so there's me. That's our health. My health, the station wagon's health, and then we have John, John Bon, John Bon John, and John Bon Bon Bon. Hmm. Is our food? Got plenty of cans, plenty of everything. Medium zombie activity. Next landmark, 230 miles. That's to Pittsburgh. Let's go. Your battery broke, but you were able to replace it from supplies. Well, God damn it! Who the hell made these batteries? It broke after two seconds of driving. <sighs> you hit a deer that jumps out in front of the car. Great, now the front of my station wagon is totally fucked up. Thank you, deer. <laughs> you hit a deer that jumps out in front of the car. Is that the same fucking deer? Did it track me and then jump out in front of the car again? Maybe it wants to die. It doesn't want to live in this cruel world. Great, well now my station wagon is half broken. Lovely. 135 miles, so we're about halfway there. You aren't sure which way to go, you lose an hour bickering with John Bon... John. <sighs> Let's keep going. What the hell happened? Looks like we stopped for a second. 
Your battery dies, you replace it from supplies. Again? Jesus. All right. Next landmark, five miles. Okay, that's Pittsburgh. Which way to go? You lose an hour of bickering with John Bon John. Again? Whoa, whoops. Shit, I don't know what I just clicked. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, Pittsburgh, click anywhere to continue. Looks like a hellhole. Again. Okay, so you can buy stuff, but of course I have no money because I didn't get any. I can sell stuff, but I don't have much of anything, so I don't want to. The thing you want to do is jobs. Because jobs will get you supplies and money. But provided you actually do them well. If you fail them, you'll lose stuff, like health and ammo and so on. Also, I need to do repairs. Wait a minute, um, okay, so I can pay to repair my station wagon, but I don't have any money. However, you can also... There's a way to repair your... your station wagon using scraps? Do I actually have any scraps? Yeah, I have ten scraps. Okay, how do I do this? I don't... Oh, is it... Oh, here we go. Yeah, repair. Alright, so the more scraps you use, the greater the chance of success. So I have ten scraps. Okay, in terms of the most efficient use of scraps, it's actually more efficient to use five for a 62% than ten for a 92. So I'm going to gamble two groups of five scraps. The only thing you actually lose by using less rather than more is just time. So let's do that. Which takes up your food by passing time. Eh, eh, eh. Oh, sweet. Successful. Alright, let's do it again. And, eh, eh. Hell yeah. Nice. Okay. Let me get familiar with this menu. So that's repair, set pace. I've never seen this before. The pace you can travel will affect uh, the pace you travel will affect your car. Take it slow and steady at 30 miles per hour. Move it with a little urgency at 45, or push the car to its limits at 60. Okay, so I guess this is basically controlling how much food you have versus how much health you have with your car, or, or like how much health your car has or how much fuel. So I guess if you have like a lot of health for it and a lot of fuel, you might want to set it to fast. But if you don't, you can set it to slow. But then you're going to go through your food faster. So right now it's set to slow. Let's just let's just leave it at slow. Yeah, that sounds good. Upgrades. Holy shit, you can actually upgrade your car. I didn't even know that. At the station wagon, the city auto shops, and infrequently while traveling on the road. Okay, well I have no money, so nope. Road map. Uh, start, finish. Where am I? Uh, where? Oh, there I am. Oh my god, I have to go all the way from there to 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 there? Jesus. It's one hell of a long route. Okay. Alright. Take a look at rationing. The amount of food that people in your party will consume each day will affect their health. Small, medium, and large portion sizes consume one, two, and three ounces of food per hour. Okay, so more food, use up more of it, but you heal more. Gotcha. So yeah, this game is all about... Well, it's all about not fucking up the mini-games when you're out scavenging and stuff. And it's also about managing your supplies efficiently. So as soon as you have a surplus of one supply, you need to probably burn it to make up for the fact that you have a surplus. I just realized I have zero batteries. Shit, if my battery goes out again, I am going to be stranded. Alright, well, I'm about to do some jobs, but before that, let's see what this is. Talk to Stranger. My father is very sick, and we are resting here until he gets better. We have been pushing too hard, and our health has suffered. When my father is able to travel again, we will go at a slower pace. Wait, what? Who was I talking to? Just a Stranger. Oh, it's just like, talk to a random person? Okay. 
There are lots of terms for the Walking Dead out there. Roamers, biters, deads, greens, shamblers, zeds, zs, whiskey, deltas. Them, those things, ruts, the unclean, zack, ghouls, deadheads, the living impaired, and my personal favorite, those fuckers. I like that one too. Wait a minute, what is combat training? You can learn new combat techniques for scavenging in small towns at the combat trainer. Hmm, this image here reminds me of something. A certain movie. I couldn't imagine what it is. Maybe it's... Oh, it must be that movie called Dijon of the Dead. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay, you can learn new techniques. Hmm. Uh, I guess... Nothing showing up. Maybe it's only at certain towns? I don't know. Alright, now let's do something. Jobs? What have we got? Recovery. A crate fell out of the back of our car on the way to town. Can you go find it? Difficulty dangerous. $26. So you want me to go find a crate in zombie infested land for $26? You're one cheap ass motherfucker. Recovery. I dropped something of great value to me just outside of town. If you find it, please return it. Difficulty normal. You know what? I'm going to be a daredevil. Let's do the dangerous one. Here we go. Travel instructions. Use WASD or arrow keys to move. Reach the goal at the end of the level to win. Pull back to aim. Release to shoot. Alright, so there's no reason to waste more ammo than you need to. Because you do have limited ammo, after all. Oh god, that one's getting close. Oh shit. Oh, ho, 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 that was close. This is dangerous. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, ah, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Ah. Trick shot. Got it. Whew. That was really dangerous. That was so close. $26. Alright, let's do the normal one. This should be easy. We're just going at the end of the level to win. Alright, same as the last one, except probably less zombies. It's kind of, I think it's all about like attracting them to one side and then, you know, juking them, going the other way. Gotta get used to this aiming. Yeah, this isn't too hard. Oh, shit. Oh shit, oh shit. Nope, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Okay, whew. You earned one scrap. All of that work for one scrap. That gives me, what, like a 20% chance to repair my car or something pathetic? Okay. Huh, so I have a bit of money. I should buy a battery because I might get stranded if I don't. How much is a battery? 42. I don't even have, have enough money for a battery. Great. Is there anything I can buy? That I need? Not really. Nope, I think it's just time to go. Here we go. Back on the road. You must cross a horde of zombies in order to continue on the road. The horde in front of you is currently massive in size and appears to be alert. Click anywhere to continue. Okay. Horde size, massive. Horde disposition, alert. In other words, holy shit, I'm gonna die. Alright, so I can wait to see if the horde disperses, break out guns and clear a path, attempt to sneak through, hire mercenaries to escort you, or get information about your choices. 
Well, I'm not gonna hire mercenaries, because that costs money. Fuck that. They're alert, so attempting to sneak through them is stupid. Clear a path is stupid, because they're massive. I'm gonna say, wait to see if the horde disperses. And there goes some more food. We're gonna starve! Okay, see, here we go. It's still massive, but they're docile. Which means that attempting to sneak through should not be a problem. Please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me, I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die. Eh? 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 Okay. You successfully, successfully snuck through the horde. 200 miles to the mall. Let's go. What's gonna happen next? Who's gonna have dysentery? Your tire broke, but you're able to replace it from supplies. Good. At least it wasn't the battery. That leaves me, what, one more tire? You find a backpack with some canned food in it. Sweet. A lucky find. You find some roadkill, it's probably safe to eat. <laughs> uh, yeah, you, you might want to cook it first, that sounds disgusting. Ooh, ooh, there it is, there it is! Uh. John Bond, did you get cholera again? What did I tell you about getting cholera? <sighs> Stupid John Bond. John Bond, you should learn from John Bond Bond Bond. And John Bond John. Take lessons from them, John Bond. The mall. <laughs> Left to die. Gee, I, I wonder if that's a reference. What the hell's wrong with those trees? It looks like they're made out of silly string. I think that's more horrifying than the zombies. Also, all of the zombies appear to be playing with pink string, which is strange. I didn't... I didn't know zombies liked pink string. Maybe the zombies are like kittens. Maybe I can distract them using pink string. Or maybe like jangle some keys in front of their face. Oh, must play with keys. So jingly. Well, it looks like some person is flashing me. So that's lovely. He appears to be selling purple dildos. I mean, orange. Sorry, I'm unable to tell colors. It's because of the cholera. It's taken away my color vision. Okay, uh, let me check my supplies. Alright, well, I'm doing really good on food, medkits, ammo, all that stuff. Fuel, good. Really need batteries and tires and scraps. I need car stuff. I really need car stuff. Hmm. Any combat training here? No, I still don't get what this is about. I could trade. A survivor, a survivor has one of their battery to offer for seven of your scrap. Well, that would actually be a good trade if it wasn't for the fact that I don't have seven scrap. Keep waiting? Nah. That's only if I'm desperate. I don't want to burn through my food. Roadmap? Great, I've gone basically nowhere. This is going to be a long trip, John, John, Bon, John, Bon, John, and John, Bon, Bon, Bon? I'm sorry, I'm already forgetting your names. What jackass named them so confusingly? Jeez. Hmm. Well, I'm already on slow, which is good. Because I have plenty of food, but not plenty of car parts. I guess I just need to scavenge. I mean, I could sell stuff, but... So what, I can sell, like, one fuel for five dollars or something? Nah. I don't want to do that. Alright, see what jobs there are. Just one, damn it. Bandits, there's a group of hostile folk who have been holed up in a nearby building. I think they mean to take over. Difficulty suicide. Fifty-seven dollars. Well, I'll do anything for 57 bucks, including kill myself. Pull back to aim, release to shoot, you are vulnerable while aiming, and so is the enemy. 
Okay, from what I've seen, I'm familiar with how this game works. It's yet another mini game. Can you feel the tension? Oh, almost got one. Eh. Damn it, missed. Damn it, I missed again. Got one. Ooh, got another one. Damn it. Oh, god, fuck, I stood up while a bullet was shooting on my head. God damn it. You just barely managed to get away. Well, that job's gone and now I'm hurt. Fuck. There are no more jobs listed. Okay, how hurt am I? Oh, that's it? That's all the damage I took? I'm fine. Looks like John Bond is taking some damage from his cholera. Well, you should have thought of that before you got cholera, John Bon. Alright, fuck it, time to leave. 142 miles to Indianapolis. What will happen next? It starts raining heavily, you will have to drive more slowly. Great. Why did we stop? You stop suddenly to avoid hitting a zombie and everyone gets whiplash. Oh, thanks. The sky clears up. Yay, it's a sunny day. Please make it, please make it, please make it, please make it. Eh, eh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You can do it, you can do it. A uh, gas can is leaking, you lose half the can. God damn it. John Bond no longer has cholera. Good, good job, John Bond. Good for you, Indianapolis. I'm not sure what I'm looking at in the... Is that water? It's either water or someone has sprayed, like, blue goo all over the streets. Hmm. Alright, let's go. Hopefully there are some good jobs here. In fact, let's just go ahead and do that first. Sweet. Bandits. Alright, so again, but this one's normal and gives me 14... Are you fucking kidding me? There are a couple of truffle makers who have been stealing from us. Dispose of them. Payment, 14 ammo. I'm going to use more than 14 ammo killing these bandits. Why, why would I take that? The only thing it's going to give me is something to make up for the ammo I just lost. Pointless. Alright, so this is bandits, but it pays 28 bucks. I'll take that. That actually makes sense. This time, let's not die. Nice. Okay, doing better. Damn it. Nice. Two more to go. Damn it. Yeah. There we go. You survived the attack. Whew. You earned 28 bucks. Sweet, now I can buy a battery. So yeah, money is not really worth much. I mean, it doesn't really get you much. I mean, it took two jobs worth of getting money just to be able to buy one battery, which you can lose in like two seconds on the road. It's brutal. Alright, auto shop. Wait a minute, there is a special, though. What's the special? Buy upgrades. Ninja Muffler automatically succeeds sneaking through hordes. That sounds awesome, but I really need a battery. Alright, let's grab one. And now I'm poor. Let's go. 212 miles to the farmland. You hit a zombie, it leaves a ding in the hood of the station wagon. God damn it. You see a tombstone by the side of the road. Would you like to stop and investigate? Sure. What could happen? Surely nothing bad could happen. 
Ian was numbed. You discover one muffler near the grave. Holy shit. What, was that like a an offering to Ian, who was numbed? You... <laughs> nice grammar. You don't notice the speed bump on the road. Everyone hits their head as you fly over it. Good job, me, because I think I'm the one driving. <sighs> now everyone is hurt. Great. The farmland. Farmland. Click anywhere to continue. Looks farmy. And full of zombies. In fact, I maybe should use my medkits. Hold on, let's take a look at the party. Yeah. Alright, how many medkits do I have? Ten medkits. Let's use one on everyone. Me, of course. One on John, one on John Bon, one on John Bon John, and one on John Bon Bon Bon. Actually, John Bon had cholera. So he could use another medkit, but on the other hand... It is, it is his fault for being so stupid as to get cholera, so fuck him. Talk to Stranger. We can't afford mercenaries. We're making our car into a tank. We'll cover up the windows, shoot from the roof, and drive through the mass. Hope we can make it while the horde is calm enough. <laughs> Good luck. Alright, what jobs can we do? Defense. There's a large number of zombies just outside my home. Please come and eradicate them. Difficulty dangerous. Payment 106 food. Holy shit, that is a lot of food. That is a lot of food. I could put us on extra rations and get extra healing. Let's do it. Alright, so this is the same minigame as the beginning of the game. Except this time I actually have ammo. On. We can do this. You just need to be calm. Wait till you reload. Take your time. Take the shots. Okay, we got this. We got this. See? Everything's good. Take your time. Uh. You survived the attack. Whew. Yeah, that aiming system is really funky and pretty damn hard to use, really. There are no more jobs listed. You earned 106 ounces of food. Excellent. Let me just check how much we have. Ooh, actually, we've burned through a lot of food. I don't think I should put us on extra rations. Nah. No, I'm gonna put I'm just gonna leave us on normal. Alright, well we're good. We could take one tire and one battery going out, so let's just uh leave. A bike gang follows you out of the settlement. <laughs> God damn it. Here's another minigame. Driving instructions, use WASD or Eric to move. Bandits will try to pull up next to you and shoot. Crash into them to knock them off their bikes. Here we go, the most intense car chase ever. And apparently they have unlimited bikes. Apparently they're clones. You know guys, if the first ten bikes didn't work, you might want to rethink your plan. Yeah. God damn it. Shit, I got hit. Oh god, the station wagon's almost dead. Oh shit, you get overrun by the bandits, they rob you of the following. $7.59 food. God damn it. And now my car is fucked. The station wagon is broken. <sighs> and what do I have, like one scrap, or did I use it all? I can't move, right? Yeah, I can't move. I gotta stop. I have no scrap. Shit. 
Well, crap. I need a scavenge. That's literally the only thing I can... Unless there's someone to trade with? No one to trade with. Yeah, I mean... Unless someone happens to stop by and sell me scrap. No, I've got a scavenge. Shit. Alright, scavenge it is. Alright, so you just need to pick up these drops that show up and try to survive. Come on, come on, looks like money. It's a wallet. Alright, anything more? Or oh, that's it. Alright, we found we found 30 ounces of food and $20. That's great, but doesn't really help me all that much, at least not with my immediate problem. Let's go scavenging again. Zombie activity high, goddammit. Oh, there's something over there. What the hell is that? I don't know what I just picked up. Alright, this looks like a bunch of food over there. Oh, more food. How did I miss that? I think that might... Oh, that's it. Alright, 200 ounces of food. Damn. I'm set for a while. And five bucks. Okay, well that still doesn't really help me. I mean, I've certainly got lots of food. In fact, I have so much food that I'm going to put us on large rations. Combat training, no. Anyone to trade with? You encounter no one to trade with. All right, let me see what waiting's gonna do. Is anyone gonna come by? Ooh, a stranger's willing to trade you seven of their scrap for 95 of your food. Holy shit, yes. Hell yeah. Uh, wants one of your muffler for two of their scrap. Will you trade? Um... I have two mufflers, and I don't have... I, I could always use more scrap, so yeah. Uh, has 43 of their food to offer for your amp? Nope. Nope. Okay, we are in business. Well, now that I've used up some more food, I'm gonna go back on normal. Alright, let's repair this thing. It is completely fucking broken. I wonder if the most efficient thing to do... I think the most efficient thing to do in terms of scrap is to just do one. 20%. Yeah, actually, it is by far the most efficient use of scrap. But inefficient use of time. But who cares? I need to repair this thing, so let's just use one scrap at a time. We'll be fine. We got plenty of food. Eh? Huh? Eh? Huh? Repair failed. Damn it. So wait a minute. I just realized, why is everyone's health going down? Shouldn't it go up? Is everyone sick or something? Damn it. I mean, do, I, do they need to be on large rations to heal? Come on, come on, come on. Yes, okay. Let's keep repairing. It is now midnight. Come on. Damn it. Damn it. Come on. Come on. Jesus. Can I get one more repair, please? Oh. 
You are telling me apart, station wagon? Please? Please? Oh my god. Well, at least I can move. You know, I'm not too happy with this, the state of that, and I don't have much money. I'm gonna scavenge again. Damn it. I'm starting to get a hang of the aiming. The fat ones are the extra strong ones. Ooh. That was it. Uh, I found some food. That's nice. I want more, though. Let's scavenge again. I've got plenty of ammo, and I'm doing pretty good at this. Alright, got some money. Holy shit, they're starting to come in strong. Okay. Alright, I think this is probably all I'm going to get. Yeah, I'm just going to wait the timer out. Don't want to waste any more ammo. Okay. Um, you also found $70. And 10 scrap, holy shit, yes, that's what I was waiting for. Okay, now I have a bunch of money. Let's repair the car some more. Uh, repair. Come on, come on. Huh? 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 <sighs> <sighs> the noise is so helpful. It's like, you know, da 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 It's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, meow. Alright, fuck this. I'm starting to lose a lot of health. Um, let's go ahead and use five. Come on. Okay, good. How much scrap do I have left? Uh, I guess two? Yep, two. Alright, let's use it. <sighs> okay, well, still, we're not doing bad. Eh, actually, we're doing pretty shitty on food. But we're doing very good on money, very good on ammo. Decently on everything else. Okay, let's go. To Chicago. Sparks shoot out of the back. Your muffler is dragging on the road. Time to replace it. You replace it from supplies. Stupid muffler. Uh, military blockades impedes your progress for an hour. Great. Yeah, I don't really get why everyone seems to be getting hurt. I mean, they're eating food. Shouldn't they be healing? 83 food in an abandoned car. Damn, sweet. Chicago. Alright, let's spend some of this money. What jobs do we have available, by the way? Some fuel and some money. Okay. How much does it cost to repair? Hold on, I can I can pay it to repair somewhere, right? Where is it? Uh, town by... Wait, I thought you could pay to repair your car, am I... 
Am I wrong? Grades road map set pace. Oh, it's right here. Well, wow. it's only nineteen bucks to repair it that much. Okay, let's yeah, let's do that. In fact, let's do it again. All right, that's good enough for now. What are my supplies? I need a muffler. I want to have at least one of everything. Let's buy a muffler. Hey, what's the special? Uh, where is it? By by upgrades. Super last tires. Less likely for tires to break. Eh. If I had money saved up, that'd be a good idea in the long term. But in the short term, I need a muffler. So no. All right, one for 47 bucks. I'm going to be poor after this. Let's buy it. All right, how's my party doing? They are pretty hurt. Oh, wait a minute. I think you rest. I think you rest to get back health, don't you? Yeah, okay. Uh, let's see what let's see how much health I'm going to get back for resting for 1 hour. Oh, wow. Okay, that was quite a bit. Um, let's do it for four. Okay, and everyone is good. I don't understand how resting is any different from just... You know, doing nothing while driving in the car? And passing time? I mean, wouldn't you heal while time is passing as long as you're not being hurt? But, I don't know. <clears throat> okay, let's do the jobs. A recovery. Need to pick something up. Difficulty normal, one fuel. That's not much fuel, but what the hell. Let's do it. Alright, I need to get the goal at the end. Ooh, that was close. Think I got this? Yep, I got this. Except for you. And... There we go, you made it. One fuel, yay! I think one fuel actually counts for quite a bit, though. So that should last me for a long while. Alright, another recovery, but this one's suicide. Payment 45 bucks, what the hell? Let's do it. Alright, I'm definitely gonna have to shoot more of them this time. Oh my god. Wow, I've got a zombie train- oh look, they got a nice little train going there, they're holding each other's shoulders. Oh, that's so cute. Holy shit, I'm actually gonna make it? Hold on, before I go there, I need to observe this zombie train. Look at that. Beautiful, they're coming together. And unification. In the unified interest of eating my face. Goodbye. You earned 45 bucks, sweet. You know what? You know what? I think I have the money to buy that special. Yes, I do. Let's do that. Let's buy it. I'll never have to buy another tire again. Or, well... Okay, it's less likely, so I might still have to buy them. But it should save me money in the long term, I think. After all, it's not all that much more expensive than just buying a tire itself, so... Yeah, I think we're good to go. 196 miles to the remote shack.
Oh, there it is. Wow, nothing bad happened. Oh my god. Well, nothing bad has happened yet. Oh, of course. You rummage two fuel off a body at the side of the road. Damn. Smooth sailing, except for something that actually happened that was good. That's rare. Gee, I wonder what this is a reference to. The remote shack. Oh, okay, so now there's something in the combat trainer. Interesting, let's see. Okay, a grizzled stranger beckons you to a dark corner and offers to teach you some useful techniques for 80 bucks. Um... What kind of techniques? Are you sure these are survival techniques and not, like, sexual techniques? A uh, chance to not use a bullet when you fire. For 80 bucks, a chance to not use a bullet when you fire? Well, I don't even have the money for that, but... I have plenty of ammo. Nah, I'm good. Okay. Party's looking good. Car's looking pretty good. Oh, you can see those blinging rims. Actually, it's not the rims, it's the tires, but whatever. Looking good. Okay, we definitely need food. Yeah, we're pretty low on food. The rationing's normal, right? Yeah. Hmm. I'm gonna leave it on normal for now. Alright, let's do some jobs. Recovery. Normal. Payment one muffler. Okay, let's do it. Could always use more mufflers. Shit. This is bad. This is bad. Oh, actually, that worked out. That actually worked out really well. Ooh, another zombie train. You made it one muffler. No more jobs. Okay, let's scavenge. I need food. <clears throat> Zombie activity high. Wow, my aim is shit. Whoa, I almost got hit there. Whoops. That was close. Okay, I think that's it. Just gonna kill time. And... Okay. You found 35 ounces of food while scavenging. You also found $5 and 10 scrap. Ooh. Okay. Well, I could definitely use more food, but I like the scrap. In fact, let's repair the car while I'm here. Yeah, I can't sit around burning my food, so I'm going to go ahead and use five. Come on, come on. Sweet. Alright, well, I guess I'm good for now. Alright, let's scavenge some more because I still need food. I think that's the only thing I've been finding. Food, sweet. The heck is that? Car parts of some sort? Alright, I think that's it. Yep. Oh my god, I found 300 ounce ounces of food. 
while scavenging, but you were only able to carry 250 ounces back. Well, damn, I'm set for a while. And 15 scrap. Holy shit. Yeah, I am good on supplies. Wow. Okay. Yeah, let's go. 260 miles to St. Louis. Uh, you, you don't notice the speed bump on the road, and everyone hits their head, and great, we're all hurt. Thank you. I blame John Bon Bon Bon. There's no way it was John Bon John. It had to be John Bon Bon Bon. Your battery broke, but you are able to replace it from your supplies. Sweet. Well, I mean, not sweet. I'm good that I was able to replace it. Not sweet that it broke. The muffler falls off the station wagon. You replace it from supplies. This thing is seems like it's literally held together with duct tape. You hit a pretty nasty bump in the road, and 26 food flies out the window. What the fuck? Well, maybe you shouldn't leave the windows open. Maybe you shouldn't leave the bags of food precariously propped up on the open windows so that they can fly out when you hit a bump. Fuck you, John Bon. I know it was you, John Bon. There's no way it was John or John Bon John. It had to be John Bon. Check engine light is on. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, I know it's fine. It's at like 75%, so... St. Louis? Uh, looks like a hellhole. Great. 